Easy and cost-effective trifle with a base cream you can make of various flavors. If you like it, please comment, I love easy desserts. And don't forget to like this video. To a large pan with the heat still off, start by adding one and one half pack of condensed milk. Each of these packs contains 395 grams. Then add 25 grams of wheat flour. Using a spoon or spatula, mix it all together very well until wheat flour fully dissolves. Did you know that recipe app, in addition to the Android version, is now also available for iPhone and iPad? So go to the comments section and download it right now. When that happens, add 450 milliliters of milk. Turn the heat on medium-low and mix it all together very well until cream boils and slightly thickens. The ingredients and directions to this recipe will be detailed in the comments section below, step by step. This is the right consistency. You may now turn off the heat and stop mixing it. After that, transfer all this cream to a medium bowl. Leave us a comment with the name of the city from which you're watching this. I'd like to give you a shout out and thank you for sharing this recipe. Then cover this bowl with a plastic bag or plastic wrap, making sure it directly touches the cream. Set cream aside and let it cool down until it reaches room temperature. Once it is cooled down, transfer all this cream to a large bowl. After that, add 200 grams of whipped cream. To make this whipped cream, I've used 200 milliliters of very cold whipped cream mixture and whipped it with an electric mixer until it turned into a consistent whipped cream with stiff peaks. Using a spatula, mix it all together very well until ingredients fully combine. Have you downloaded that recipe app on your phone yet? It's already available for download. I'll leave the app link for download here in the comment section. Go ahead and download it right now. This is the right consistency, a creamy and smooth mixture. To a medium glass dish, add some of this cream, just enough to cover its bottom and form the first trifle layer. I'm using a 1.6 liter glass dish. Then make the second layer with some cornstarch biscuits. For this dessert, we'll be using 200 grams of biscuits. For the third layer, cover all these biscuits with 100 grams of diced peaches. For this recipe, we'll be using 300 grams of canned peaches in syrup. For the fourth layer, add half of the remaining cream and evenly spread it with the spatula to make sure all the peaches have been covered. Now make another layer of biscuits, forming the fifth layer. Then for the sixth layer, cover these biscuits with 100 grams of diced peaches. For the seventh and final layer, add the remaining cream all over the peaches and evenly spread it with the spatula to form a flat top. If you've made it here, that means you're enjoying our recipe. So click the share button and share this video with all your friends. It won't cost you anything, but for us, it will make all the difference. Finally, sprinkle some milk powder all over this dessert. To decorate it, add one peach cut into slices, just like I'm doing here. Then add one cherry in syrup to the center of these peach slices. This decoration is totally optional and to taste. If you don't want to add it, you don't have to. Take it to the fridge and let it chill for at least three hours. The recipe is ready. You may now get some and enjoy it. I really hope you like this recipe. Now I'll head back to the comments section and will continue to answer everyone who left the name of their city. And I'll also thank you for sharing this recipe. See you next recipe. Bye.